Hi guys, um, it's Laura coming at you with another video. Um, today I wanted to do my very first Sephora plan unboxing. Um, I'm very excited. I already know what's in there. Um, but let's get into it. Okay. So open up, it looks like this. Fantastic. See other people do this all the time. And there's, there's supposedly great comes in here. Why do I say supposedly? I already looked at it. And then there's the little card thing that you can take into Sephora, but I will live by Sephora. So then the bag is see through, which is fine because, you know, I guess I already looked at it. So let's just open it right up. I really like the way it feels. I know it's a weird thing to say, but it just, it's a nice plastic. All right. So we'll do the perfume sample first. I don't know anything about perfume. I don't know how to describe the notes. I don't even know how to say this name, but I'm going to go for it. So it is the Toka Au de Perfume, and it's called Stella. What is it? Is it too bright in here? All right. Um, all it says is a temptuous young Italian beauty, tempting blood orange and spicy lily flirt with white freesia and sensual sandalwood. I don't know what that means. But I think I described it as a an old lady to a friend. Oh, I got it on my lip. But it's kind of, I do smell the citrus, the orange in there, and there's just like a little bit of floral. But I think I like it. I'm not quite sure. I need to wear it in order to see, you know, how it smells on me. There we go. Comes in a little bottle. It is so bright. Why is it so bright? And it's just a little spray bottle. All right. So the next item in here is Belief Hungarian Water Essence. Aqua-based formulation, increased hydration level. It's dermatologically, dermatologically tested. All right. So the bottle. And it's got a little pump on it. And I think it's just a moisturizer. Apply evenly to face and neck after cleansing and toning. Yeah, this is a moisturizer. It's a really nice uh, pump, and it really does just feel like I put water on my hand, but it does have a little bit of a stick to it. So we'll try it out. I have really oily skin, usually I don't moisturize, I know that's bad, don't follow my footsteps, but you know, what can you do? Okay, next we have... Ah, oh, yes, we have the magnet. Oh, Nude Sticks Magnetic Matte Lip Color in the color Graystone. Probably won't even be able to see that. But this is the color I'm wearing on my lips right now. There's a close up of the color. It's a really uh, cool toned gray, and I really like it. I've never worn this kind of color on my lips, but I think I like it. Okay, next we have um, a Tristique item. Oh, it's a mini highlight stick. Okay, this is what the packaging looks like. I really like this, like cat thing it looks like it's not it doesn't have a cat but it actually does 
when you open it. And this one you can actually twist up. And since it's a highlighter, I don't know if you'll be able to see it on my hand, but we'll try. Oh, you can. Ooh, look at it. It's a really great, like, pinky, frosty color. I don't know. I'm not wearing it. Maybe I'll put it on. Yeah, that's what I thought. You can't really see it. I have, like, a really blinding highlight. Maybe on my knuckles. No? Okay. I tried. I guess I didn't pick the best lighting for this, but what can you do? Like I said. Okay. Second to last item, we have the Taja Pure One Step Camellia Cleansing Oil. Ooh. Now I saw this, and I immediately thought that I would never be able to use it. But I'm going to try it once and see what it does. And if it doesn't work for my skin, because like I said, I have really oily skin, then I'll just give it to a friend. But um, I'm going to open it up well, first. I'll show you packaging. Put it on my hand, see what happens. Ooh. That really, like, you, I mean, obviously it's a cleanser, so you can't see it, but do you see that shine right there? It's because it really, truly is an oil. That weirds me out. Not gonna lie. Alright, last item in the bag. Ooh, I used this today on my ends. I was in the shower. I don't know. It doesn't look too different from the rest of my hair. But, um, this is the Rahua, Rahua Omega 9 Hair Mask, which is 100% plant derived and rainforest grown. Alright, cool, cool. And the directions for this, it's just a, like a leave in. It's not a leave in. Don't leave it in your hair. It is a conditioner basically that you leave in your hair for 10 to 15 minutes I did not leave it in that long it felt like a long time I don't know this is what the packaging looks like and if I recall correctly I used like half of this just for the ends of my hair and my hair is not that long in my opinion and it's not that thick either so I don't know um, what's going on with this, but it didn't seem like there was a lot to be, because I, I would want to use it a couple times to see what's going on, see how it actually affects my hair like over time. But that is it for the bag. There's nothing else in there. Completely empty. I still really like the way this feels. I don't know. It's weird, but I like it. Alright, well, that is my, what is it, May? My May uh, Sephora Play Unboxing. And I can't wait to get next month's, actually. Um, however, next month, if I film it, I will be filming at home because I'm at college right now. Oh, I left my dresser drawer open. Whoops. Um, so. Thank you for watching, and uh, I hope to do more videos like this in the future. Like I said, I don't know. The quality is probably not that great because I'm recording on my laptop, but I hope that maybe I can get serious about this and get an actual camera that actually looks good because it might look okay in person or on camera, but like this makeup looks terrible in person. <laughs> but we don't need to talk about that. Alright, like I said, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.